Now that the initial slot has been programmed and I'm happy with the code, in this video I'll demonstrate four different methods to make the sub-program cut all four slots. For these samples I have set the part 0 to the center of the four slots. The first method I'll demonstrate to pattern the slot is to position the cutter over the start of each slot using the absolute coordinate system and then calling up the incremental sub-program. In this example I code the tool to feed to Z0 on the same line as the sub-program call. Because of this, it's important that Geo1Z0 be coded before the sub-program call, or otherwise it will not be executed. In this sample, I'll use the local coordinate system to position the tool over each slot, and then run the sub-program to cut the slot. After the first slot is cut, the G52X2.688Y0.5 is programmed. This will activate the local coordinate system, and temporarily make this location the new part 0. Then the tool is moved 10 thou in the x-axis because the sub-program was written to start off center by this amount. Next it will feed to Z0 and run the sub-program again to cut this slot. After the slot is cut, the tool is above the top face and the local coordinate system is cancelled by the G52X0Y0 and the G54 is again the active work offset. Again, the G52 is used to shift the work coordinate system over the third slot. It is then cut and the G52 is cancelled. One last time the local coordinate system is used to position the tool over the last slot, which is then cut and the G52X0Y0 is again programmed to cancel the local coordinate system and return to the G54 work offset. In this sample, I'll use the mirror image M code to cut the second, third, and fourth slots. After the first slot is cut, I'll program M21 to mirror all of the x-axis coordinates. Then I'll position the cutter as I did at the start of the tool feed to Z0 and cut the second slot with the subprogram. As soon as this slot is done, I'll code M22. This will mirror the Y coordinates. Now that both the X and Y coordinates are being mirrored, the third slot can be cut. To cut the last slot, I'll first program M23 to cancel mirror image, then code M22 to mirror the Y coordinates, and then cut the fourth slot. After this final slot is cut, the M23 will be programmed again to cancel the mirror image. The final method I'll demonstrate to cut the three remaining slots is to use coordinate rotation. Once again, after the first slot is cut, I'll program G68, X0, Y2.0, R180. This will turn on the coordinate rotation with the center of rotation being at G54, X0, Y2.0. The R180 tells it to rotate the coordinates counterclockwise 180 degrees relative to the center of rotation. Now the second slot can be cut. After the second slot is cut, the G69 will cancel the coordinate rotation. The third slot will then be cut by setting the center of rotation for the coordinates at X0, Y0 and programming a clockwise rotation of 180 degrees. To cut the fourth and final slot, the G69 will be programmed after the third slot. Then the G68 will set the new center of rotation at X minus 2.688 Y0 and rotate the coordinates by 180 degrees. Next, the fourth slot will be cut, and after the fourth slot has been machined, once again the G69 will cancel the coordinate rotation.